What's up guys? Kenny back at it again. Me and Kristoff ready to go racing. What's he doing already? Shoes are soaked already. Shoes so. are soaked. Look who just showed up. About time you showed up. Are you ready to go? I'm very ready to Wait, go. who are you again? I'm Courtney. Nice to meet you, Courtney. Circus just showed up. Watch this. Late as usual. Yeah. Let's go see what he's got going. Shows up in his old fucking chef. Stop. <laughs> Yo, here we go. What are you doing at home? Getting ready. First things first, you got my password? Yeah. I thought you had it. No, I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're yeah, fucking bringing, yeah, the like, bringing the Mexican across the border. <laughs> hey, fuck it. The nickname was Chavez in Illinois. Don't forget that. Got the dually back. Might as well. The real dually, not that old raggedy ratchet thing we had in Chakfee. Well. Everything. Wouldn't be a trip if we weren't fixing shit before we leave. <laughs> Joe brought dinner over. A man of many names. We got the we got the Canadians arguing over the Donald Trump and all the all the politics going on right now. I don't pay attention enough to understand it or 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 at all. So these guys are arguing. No, no, he says Trump's a bad businessman. No, I said yes. That's what you no, said. Me. I said I love Trump. Celebrity Apprentice. Nah, I'm the fucking, you know, ruler of the free world. Yeah, like All I know is, ago. everybody says, J.O. says he's a bad businessman. All I know is that he ain't poor. No. He got himself there somehow. But his old man left him 500 And I think he's done good for the country. Sorry for all you Trump haters, but. <laughs> so we're on the road to Deadwood. We got the crew here. Kristoff, Courtney, can't really see. Turn the lights on in here. There we go, we got Courtney and Circus. Original yeah. Circus. Yeah. Nothing gets better than this, right? All a bunch of friends just heading racing. It's 7.30, we're just rolling through Grand Marais, Minnesota. We're gonna drive through the night tonight. Be in Deadwood probably around, I don't know, eight o'clock in the morning. Me and Christopher will switch off driving through the night. This is what we like, just kids rolling. No parents, just make our own rules. I really gotta put it out there for the people that make this possible. All my local sponsors and uh, everyone else. You know, one thing a lot of people don't think of as well too is I work full time throughout the summer and the winter. And uh, so I don't get to ride my snowmobile. Like most of the kids that, that I race against, they get to practice usually like at least two or three times a week where I'm just happy to get on on and on the weekend on to race. So I'm basically just a weekend warrior. So I wouldn't wouldn't be able to do it with all my local sponsors to, to get me here as well. Then, all right, we no, got, our, we got the podcast daddy, rolling. Not yours, not mine. Now. Her. <laughs> Her time. Oh, it's like people have Episode 69, baby. Did you guys for a while. Know? We're back at it again. We have new microphones. These I, girls are These hot. are great. They're kind of big. So you, the reason I pulled you over is you got a trailer light out on your trailer. Oh, really? We just literally we just checked yeah, those it's the, we uh, it's the left rear trailer light. Running light or brake light? Running light. Okay. Yeah, but okay. you got everything else. So you got a race coming up or? Yeah, we're just heading to South Dakota. Okay. What's over in South Dakota? Snowmobile race. Is it like a big one or is it just like yeah, a... It's Okay, we literally just got fucking pulled over for a trailer like I thought I was speeding but guess not. Wee woo wee woo. You know, just driving away, roads are glare ice. To the floor, not going anywhere. We got no trailer lights. We got the fucking circus under here. How's it going under here? Fucking nice. Just dandy. No trailer lights. Well, we had half a side till fucking circus went under there. Oh, well, so you sat me under here for Worried fucking... about 12 volt shocking him. Well, he's just a good... You got wire? Yes, I had to buy a fucking connector, but we got wire. So, sitting out here in the snow, you know, fixing the trailer lights. Sent J.O. under, because, you know, he's smaller fit under there a little easier get him to fix it we're going on like what 40 minutes now boys send me to the junction box no i said trace the wire back don't worry boys i got it handled i told jo to trace the wire back to the junction box he said yep yeah, we're good we're good must be in the junction box well no Br clean break right before junction box he missed her right now? oh look at that we got lights we're good it's now 5 15 in the morning just about in kadaka roads are not the best driving good then all of a sudden glare ice sideways and tires on this truck ain't the best right now not even all seasons he's all over he's sleeping back there Ooh, look at that Ooh, sideways traction control we'll make her 
be a little slower than we would be. But once again, we're making her and that's what counts. Well, I just gotta say, Stem, we're beating your fuel mileage, but nothing else is new. <laughs> just about rolling into Rapid City here. Coming up on a friendly racer here. Let's see this, we're actually going in. Freeland Racing. Gotta be looking sexy for Perkins, right? Let's go eat some Perkins. You're gonna start this like this. So we're leaving Perkins and we're all in the truck. And we're on our way to Deadwood now. It's about an hour to go. And uh, Joel comes walking out of Perkins. Got me some cheesecake pie. Eating more fucking pie to go. <laughs> we're at Deadwood. Track will be up over there. See what these fags are up to. Sup, baby? Yeah, you want to be in our vlog? Might as well put me in it. Fucking man! Fucking man! Ow! What up, Hey, Tony. Hey, Gary. Want to be in our vlog? Well, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker here is getting his sled ready to go. Practice mint's perfect. Time. Mint. Fucking oh, mint. Yes. Does it get better any of it? It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't get better than this. So here we are. Deadwood, South Dakota. And the first part of our race weekend starts with a test mm -hmm. move. Then he's going to be practicing. It starts. So we're trying to find you know it's high elevation here and it's warm out so just trying to get the best setup possible for the weekend. Sled's being responsive so far. Let's go buddy. Let's see a good start. Morning guys, Friday, it's race day. Sled's getting ready to go. Christopher, what are you doing today? A little bit of clutching. A little bit of clutching. J.O. What up? What are you cooking? A little bacon eggs. See what's bacon. going on. Missy. Getting ready for the day. Getting ready for the day. Let's go racing today. Yeah. Expert mechanic Chris Tack is here, Kenny Mandrick. He's ready to go for heat one of South Dakota, Deadwood. This thing's gonna be an absolute beauty. See how this sled's put together just fine. And the competitor over here, he's still he's still ripped apart. Kenny gives a thumb. Oh yeah, that's that's as good as a thumbs up, but you know, beautiful day here in Deadwood, about one degree, you know, 37, whatever you want to do. It's gonna be a good day racing. Let's go! Here we go. Race one, heat one, deadwood. Let's go. It's a packed heat though, so we're going to see how this turns out. That was nice. Go kid, go kid, go. Go kid. Go. second, here we go. He's hunting all the way down. Let's see what this triple does. Woo, buddy! 
kid. There we go. Oh, come on, I'll read fucking send it, boys. Go, Kenny, you got her. Here we are, Deadwood, round one. Yes, you. Oh, it just turned off. Because you hit the fucking play button, just turn it on. No, the Chris been telling me I could just go like this. Here we are. Hey! Yo, yo. It's coming here from Deadwood, round one. The kid made the finals. Unfortunately, out of the finals. Here we go. Holy shit. Kids in third. Pro line final just finished. Pump for Jay Lara. Good job, Jay. I knew the other guy was here. Fuck these guys. What Jay will say? I couldn't believe we were playing blackjack with a pro guy last night. They're oh, sick. They're Camille fucking sick. Camille just landed on your, your turf. Good morning, Hopefully he's going to be alright. This guy is shocked he was playing blackjack with him last night. I'm not shocked. I thought it was pretty cool. But we were giving him a hard time. Meanwhile, we're here watching the fucking ride. I'm all brushing my teeth. Austin says he needs to use my practice sled for to race tomorrow. Down there. Christopher told him to take it easy because there's no bolts in the side panels. Blew both side panels off. Doesn't know how to put them back on. Fucking skidoo rider. Oh, count one-hander. So, Chris, quite want to leave yet? He's talking with the key. So, he looks the car back. <laughs> what up, Sam? Man, just had some people. We'll see what happens. So sometimes when you're out here, you just gotta play a trick on your fellow riders. Hopefully we got enough of this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get away, go, go, go. Say hi to everybody back home. Fucking minute. <laughs> well, two o'clock in the morning. Sam's just going to bed right now. Chris, he's having a mechanic talk. Great day, beautiful weather. Not necessarily uh, the best result. Kenny finished in solid six though. We're here for a good time. We're here for some friends. I love Deadwood, but there's a reason why I hate it. Look how dirty this shit is. All right, so dressed. we're sitting here talking, shooting the shit while Kenny gets dressed. And a little something, something might have come up. So if y'all didn't hear, or you hear, or whatever the fuck, may or may not a, you know, stole a hotel maintenance van in Geneva last March. That was me. <laughs> Anybody you from ISOC or whoever in the, you know, Amazon community, Hi. No. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> we don't drink no more. Probably for good measure. So we're on the waters now. So this is what all went on that night. A couple whiskeys, quite a few whiskeys, a couple shotgun twisted teas. No cost banquet, 650 people or so. So a lot of drunk motherfuckers. Go to the dance. Dancing your face off, spilling drinks, getting hammered, hammered. Meanwhile, I'm sitting with the mechanic and our good buddy from Illinois. What up? Sitting there with them and I'm thinking I'm dead alone. I find you guys in the lobby. Oh, we're going up to whoever's hotel room, blah, blah, blah. All right, Chris, what happened then? Turn around and Jail was gone. Gone. Gone, vanished. So I did the old one of these, talking to him like this, and then the And walked out the door. Come down. We wait, wait, we wait for a shuttle ride to get in. And the guy's going, yeah, someone just stole the maintenance van like 10 minutes ago. And me and Sammy here are like, who the fuck would have stole the what, maintenance no, van? What fucking idiot because tried to do that? the keys were hid underneath the cup holder, and Josh is just not smart enough to find keys under the cup holder. Hopping, the keys were in the cup holder, and I started the cocksucker up as I pulled out of the little, you know, lobby overhang. Pull out, a security guard happened to be going by, I almost T-boned him. <laughs> <laughs> so then I'm sitting there, and then he's like, ooh, looking at me like this, and then all of a sudden his eyes go like, wait a second. And he kind of realized maybe that kid in a button up shirt shouldn't be driving a hotel maintenance van. So I'm sitting there holding my hand on the door. As soon as his door opened, I started jumping. Kenny, what did I tell you? He said, I don't know how those cops caught me. I had to jump on them. <laughs> but <laughs> the he's fucking like, Dad's probably driving away. No, yeah, he started rolling towards the security guy. I remember blacked. I'd like to think I'm fast personally. <laughs> no, um, no, ate no. shit on my face. You're they jump on my back, coughed, whole ordeal, not even two minutes in the back of a cop car. And then you guys come outside. I'm sitting in the damn cop cars and walking by. <laughs> Drove right by him. Yeah, yeah. like a solid gun. How Ended much up that, getting... How much that call cost you? Thousand dollars for bail. Eighty nine hundred for lawyer fees. <laughs> <laughs> 850 bucks to blow in a breathalyzer or get my blood taken at the hospital, which I didn't quite remember. 
and was only in jail for 24 hours. We are round two, Deadwood. See what the boys can do. See what the boys can do. Yeah. Hoorah. Hoorah. <laughs> Old man Stam, what up? Kenny's in the third heat. It's packed once again. Heat one didn't go Kenny's way. A little bumping and banging, but you know that's no problem. Heat two though, he killed it. LCQ. So it's gonna go great. Here we go. This gonna be the best vlog so far. Well, of course. Went seven on my first heat. I bounced back with a win in the heat two. Had to go LCQ. Just come away with second place. So we're in the final, but we're back row. But. <laughs> Wow. Ah, Shout out Groomer. to Gary Groomer. <laughs> We're up. Just finally getting some groomer time here. This is Steve, the unsung hero of Amazon Snowcross. Say hi to the fans back in Canada. How's it going? Is it going? Or yeah, it's going. <laughs> <laughs> I said when that fucker went by, when fucking uh, Elias went by right here, can this way, I literally felt my brain go out both ears a little bit. Just, <laughs> wow. uh, not very fucking good. Two good hole shots. Corners, it's kind of hard to do whatever, and they bumped me out of the way, but keep digging for the final. That's right. Let's get it, boy. Pro final, baby. Let's go race. Woo! So pro final on Saturday night just finished. Daniel Benham completely cleaned house. So it was a good race for him. Oh, but I don't understand how Elias saved. He come off the the, the rhythm section before a triple completely sideways. I don't know how the fuck he saved it. But Half off. It was fucking mint. And time to load up. Time to load up. We're going home. Loading up the old bit. Anybody seen Kristoff? No, he's kind of lost. He's with his mechanic. We're no good no more. The garbage man. How do he? He, he showed he up this weekend. He showed up this weekend? Shit. He said he was going to be here at 9 o'clock this morning. When did he show up? I think it was, oh Not, fuck, 9 p.m. Yeah, some bitch. 12 <laughs> hours late, garbage man. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Get in the fucking trailer and clean your gitch up. Hey, babe. You got your gitch cleaned up? Got it all cleaned up. So Dakota recap. On our way home now. We just packed up. Just heading home. Uh, we're going to drive through the night again tonight. Should be home around 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. Well, 14 hours. Friday, uh, went 4-3 in the heats uh, for ninth pick for final. Got sixth and wasn't too happy with that. So, so Saturday, if heat one it was really bad. I got seventh and I was not happy after that. I bounced back with a win in heat two though and still put me in the LCQ. Got second in that, so I was back row for final and then made my way up to fourth from the back row in the final. So pretty happy with that, you know, rode good. Still still lots of work to be done, so to get up on that box. But we'll be there, we'll be there, that's for damn sure. As far as parts going the slide, we didn't blow no reeds this weekend. Struggled on Friday with trying to get a setup that was good on track and start. We had a setup to get good starts, but it wasn't as good on track and we had a setup for good riding on track, but starts aren't as good this morning we made a little change and i think it was definitely better today bringing the race sled home gonna do a rebuild on it gonna look a little different in dubuque I'll leave that a surprise deadwood's always a good time all the way from thunder bay cambridge here on kenny mandrick this is a hell of a time these two guys this motherfucker right here and this something else guy right here two guys are wild they travel the countryside yeah this is legit this is unreal so generally when we travel I don't know, other people might not do it, but I like to keep tabs on where everyone is. We're leaving Deadwood here. Got the snap maps open. There's Stammy Whammy. Bissell Missile. That's Mitchell. That's Gary Bubbler. So, <laughs> they're only in Rapid City. We're going to pass them all. 
Stay tuned. Let's fucking go. Getting fuel, eh, Josh? Hi, how about? How do we get to the races? I like think Visa. Yeah. It's the only way we get to the races, baby. <laughs> I locked it up and stopped. Oh, my God. Well, boys, got around them. To the front. <laughs> On the way home, just just past your Mankato, Minnesota. Checking out the Winter X Games snow bike. So it's a big accomplishment if he's able to check out friend. What? Look at Malian's tongue. Oh fuck. Put her teeth right through it. Gross. You alright? Nasty.